It's nothing I hear greater when it's coming to my family. I keep my girls right by my side like a fanny. Giant crawling to the zone and she so fancy. Dirty came out first, so she so unlike her daddy. I just wanna give my girls the world and make them happy. You shit out my girl, I can't wait till we get married. My bad come for anything. I run up a bad song about that wedding ring. I can never repair, she gave me my offspring. Good morning, happy vlogmas. Day 21, um, I'm about to go head to the house um, so we can do this last walkthrough. And before I left, I wanted to show y'all some of the stuff that I just got from Pet Pet. Um, I'm not gonna show one of the items because nine times out of 10, that's the girl's birthday outfit. Um, I told you all that they were gonna be working with this company. It's not Pet Pet, it's another company, but I just looked at the items that they sent and it does not go with the theme. I didn't tell them like color. I was just hoping that it would go with the theme, um, but the items that they sent does not. So I was like, you know what? Um, I'll, they'll probably just wear it because it's a it's a it's two red dresses. Um, so nine times ten, they'll either wear it on Christmas or just another day because there's really really dressy dresses and the theme and all the activities that's going to be at the birthday. I want the girls to be a lot more comfortable. Blah blah blah. Um, and then when I opened up the pet pet package, I was like, oh my gosh, the one the outfits like is perfect color, perfect everything. And Babe could literally customize some things on um, the shirt part of it. So that's just what we'll nine times out of ten do um but anyways i still wanted to show some of the other items that i got this time around um i didn't get too many outfits because now that it's cold outside the girls like i really like like them the look of the nice um socks and the tights as you guys can see and they have like the cutest tights and socks and accessories and all of that look at these shoes you guys these are so cute Got these shoes right here now like I said I have so many outfits that I got from Gap that I showed y'all um, last week whenever I went to Gap and went power shopping for the girls I got a lot of red outfits so I don't know if they are gonna wear these on Christmas but this is a good option for them and I told you guys I had got them some bowls some Christmas bowls and birthday bowls and regular bowls because I found a, a, a really great bowl maker on Etsy I'll give her information after the girls birthday party so don't worry about that um, but yeah also the girls pet pet coat will be across the screen look at this you guys look at these cute socks look at this and i've recently been <laughs> preferring to work with companies for the girls than even myself like so many companies have been reaching out my manager handles all this all the stuff but i always get like real proactive and real excited when it's something for the girls because i don't know i just like the girls having you know all this cute type um this cute stuff but look at this hat you guys you see the quality of this? Really nice quality, really, really inexpensive. But like I said, the girls have a coupon code. I have it across the screen. This is a um, like a scarf. So you'll put this on the baby's neck and keep them warm. And I've been looking for like hats and scarves for the girls, but I can't find them anywhere in store. Um, so as a matter of fact, let me show y'all. The girls are kind of napping right now. And like I said, I'm about to head out. I've been, I woke up, I ate and I went right back to sleep. Let's see this. See how pretty it is. Really pretty. Um. Yep. So, like I said, I'm gonna have the coupon code across the screen. Okay, guys. So it's been a long time coming in this humble abode. I am leaving. We just did a little walkthrough. And it's crazy because Jeremy was so adamant, like we gotta repaint the um, we gotta repaint the girls' room back, blah 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 blah. Cause you know, like when we lived at the apartment, uh, when we were moving out, like they tried well, we didn't even paint there, but it was some other stuff that they were like being really, really nitpicky about and um which was very, very excess because it wasn't even that big of a deal so jeremy was like look we ain't i'm not trying to hear nobody's mouth so we did we just did the walkthrough and we only finished painting the room well they only had enough paint for the room and not the bathroom but he was like oh it's not even that big of a deal it looks great <laughs> he was like oh you didn't even have to paint it i was like really we did all that now i got called babe and tell him like he was psyching out literally for nothing like literally because i kept telling him i was like babe i don't think it's gonna be that big of a deal because you know it's not like graffiti like it's a 
pretty paint like it's really really pretty and it was expensive too and he was like no i just don't want them to try to say anything and blah 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 then they say oh we gotta hire the top painter of america and then they trying to charge da 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 but he was just like no it's not even a big of a deal like you didn't even really have to repaint it's fine um but yes you guys so i got a lot of errands i have to run today and i need to go and get some hair for the wedding i gotta get my hair done tomorrow um i gotta go get my shoes for the wedding i gotta pick up my dress for the wedding um and i need to i really need to go get my toes done and Ariel's having her Christmas party today, but I told her I was gonna come, but she's, it starts at nine, but when I texted her today, she was like, oh, get there around 10, because everybody's gonna show up around 10. I was like, I'm not gonna have energy. I'm not, like, I know I'm not. So I was like, I may not go, especially, I, like, I don't wanna overexert myself. So I'm in a wedding, and then I have a lot of wedding stuff to do tomorrow, and then we got rehearsal on Sunday, and then the actual wedding on Monday. And if I go there tonight, then I know I'm not gonna get back until later, then I gotta still edit the vlog, yada, yada, yada. And since I already have all these errands to run, I just feel like it's just gonna be too much on me right now. It's gonna be way too much on little old me. So I may have to just sit this one out. Um, But like I said, I'm on my way to go get my hair. It's, it's still early, it's 12.46, so if I can get another nap in, I'll still try to go, because I really want to be able to go and, you know, support and even show face. But I just don't have no energy, and I just would rather, you know, be at someone's event, able to, you know, really truly support and have fun, blah, 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 and I know I'm gonna be sitting there like a bump on the road, and that's just not good for anybody, so. Okay guys, so I am leaving shoeless, but it is okay because I just called another store because they had every freaking five available for me to try on in another color, the goldish color, um, and not the silver one. They didn't have none of that available, so I called another store while I was in here. I was like, let me just call because this little online inventory thing is not as accurate as you would think um but obviously he the guy was like oh you know we can sell out throughout the day or sometimes it takes like a few days to update in the database or whatnot so yeah last but not least i have a plan d which is another shoe that i already currently have if all things fail um and of course i already had talked to jazz because of my freaking feet dilemma and it is so annoying during times like this because the only shoes that I could fit like that are heels are designer heels. So I have to spend thousands of dollars just to wear a heel. And I, I was like, I'm not about to spend like a thousand dollars, especially in the designer heels I like. Them things hurt and I gotta stand up and uh-uh, it's, it's definitely not. Uh, we just took them outside the walk and they got it. They both mastered it. You, wait, do, you wanna just show them just for two seconds? Come on, come on, let's show them what you can do. Come on, Jeremy. We don't like, I don't wanna show in a, oh! But mama out here, baby. Come here, come here, baby, come here. Jaya, where are you going? Jaya, I just, what, where are you trying to go? There must be something in there she see. The remote. Look, look. Yeah. You know it, you got it, you got it, you got it, yeah, Jaya. Girl, you got it, you rock my world. Good job. Okay, I'm gonna give you the ball. Journey Bean. Come on, let's shut on your stuff. Let's shut on your stuff. She wanna get the shoes. Uh-uh, mama. Come on, shut them, them what you can do. Shut them, mama. Come on, Journey. Go down. I need something to bribe her again. They want to do it outside. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, there's the ball. Oh, ooh, ooh. There you go, Miss Journey B. Look at you, big girl. Look at you. Turn it around. Turn it around. Look at. I don't know why I take it. <laughs> and it keep getting get stuck on the carpet. Journey, Bean, and Jaya, there. On your mark, 
On your mark, get set. Okay, mama, mama gonna say go. Go. On your mark, get set. Journey, you in last place. <laughs> okay, here's the prize. Oh, thank you. Journey Ben, you said you had enough. Come on, Mama. You said I was in my own race. I'm in my own lane, mommy. I'm in my own lane. No, not second. Jay going outside of you. Yo, look at Jaya. Parked at the door. I'm not leaving you, baby. I was just trying to show Jaya parked out. Parked out. Wow, but you can't lick it, mama. You can't lick it. Is it bouncy? Wow, Ja, you gotta come back now. Dad, dad's ball. Dad, dad's ball. Y'all wanna make the gingerbread house? What is the gingerbread house that is? See, she's a master and walk, walk for you. You wanna walk today? You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Come to mommy. Come to mommy. No, come on, baby. Oh, oh, don't hurt yourself. Don't hurt yourself. Mmm. I guess she's been steady on the car because that's what she was walking in. You want to get out now, Journey? But if you don't let me out of this, oh yeah, oh look at her. Yeah, Mommy's so proud of my ink faces. <laughs> mm. Mama's so proud of you, Journey Bean and Jayo Pia. Y'all want to do the gingerbread house? Look, babies. You want to do the gingerbread house? Jaya. Y'all going to play the ball together? Oh, play together. Journey. You got to roll it back to Jaya. There you go. Jaya, there you go. You see how careful they are? Okay guys, we're about to do the gingerbread. We're about to do the gingerbread. Yeah, yeah. go Jaya in the gingerbread man. Go Jaya in the gingerbread man. Go Jaya in the gingerbread man. Look what mama got. Hey Journey. Uh-uh. Hey Journey, it's the gingerbread man. Hey Journey, it's the gingerbread man. You wanna get to it already? Okay. Sit back and let mama open it up. Mama not a good opener, so it's gonna be kinda janky. Wow. 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 Wow, lady. Look at all this stuff we got. this stuff we got a nice clean gingerbread house look ladies we even get these to decorate uh, she want my phone you gonna have even more fun with this baby look
How you do it, where you wanna do it? Yeah. Look, mama's gonna show you. You can put a J. And then. Mm -mm. That didn't look too good, babies. Mommy messed up already, y'all. J. Look, look, look. Okay, you all try. Look, look. Here's the cracker. You do it on the cracker. Hold it, hold it. Squeeze. Yum. You can, you can <laughs> taste it. Okay, here. Have this one. We gotta be a little bit more patient. Look, we even have these. Okay, you all do these. These must be a little. Sorry, guys. Okay, you know, that's enough. Mmm. Look, look what you can do. Mmm. Stick that on there. Your turn, Journey. Hold it. Hold it like a big girl. And stick it on there. Ah. Got it? No. <laughs> uh-uh. We sticking it on. Look, look, look at mama. Wow. Your turn. Uh-uh. <laughs> Journey. This right here is a catastrophe. Just like y'all show. Okay, y'all, you try. And you stick it on here. Uh -uh. Look at mama, look. Wow. <coughs> Gentle. Want to experiment? You get the experiment. Hold it. You, I can't hold you, mama. Here. Here. You hold it. Jaya, you gotta hold it. Look at Journey. Look at Journey. Mm.
Journey just mm -hmm. going crazy with this gingerbread man. Mmm. 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 Now you happy? Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> I'm gonna get you one too. Go ahead, Mama. You wanna get you one too? Don't lose it. Jay, I thought I put some out for you right here. Mm. I'm doing all that fussing. All that fussing. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Bye bye. I'm not leaving. Just say bye bye to them. A little snack. Hey guys, I promise this is the last day of me looking like who did it and why. Um, it's like nah. Uh, I'm tired I want to go to bed so I'm gonna just finish up this vlog I did go and pick up my dress I got my shoes everything is great get my hair done tomorrow got my nails done everything is moving along the way it should um it looks like I'm not gonna make it to Ariel's party tonight well one I am tired but two most importantly because my um my mom went back home because she was at the house with, you know, her husband yesterday while they was painting. So they didn't even leave until late. And then she still came back early this morning here um, because I had to go run around and do wedding errands. Babe didn't even go to sleep until like five o'clock this morning. He came home, brought like two loads of truck worth of stuff here um, and then left back out to because y'all know he had built the studio in the uh, basement and i told y'all he has ocd about making sure everything is back to where how we found it which is a good thing but me i was like i could care less <laughs> um like now they got a free studio but he went and actually like took the whole studio thing apart and took all the wood out the house and everything and he left out um because he still had to go get some miscellaneous stuff when i did the walkthrough because the basketball goal was still there the pool table was still there somebody was supposed to be coming to get it but you guys i just really did not care that much about it i said if somebody does not get this freaking pool table i don't even care at this point just freaking leave it there like just leave it there it's not even that big of a deal but we were trying to find somebody to get the pool table uh the pool table is very heavy and i was telling baby not stress yourself out about this pool table Cause he had got it for a deal to begin with so it's not like he spent thousands of dollars um and we can just get a new pool table when we move and um yeah but when i did the walk through y'all know that freaking clock that i had from um z gallery from two apartments three places ago because we had the house apartment and then an apartment the apartment y'all met jeremy at remember when i first moved in and i went to z gallery that freaking 400 hundred dollar clock it's been going with me near far and everywhere y'all so i'm doing a little walk through and i'm like why is this clock still sitting here so i was like yeah but you need to go back to that dang old house and get that clock because i need that clock that clock is too nice i know it's heavy as crap sorry y'all i'm like i just didn't get off this camera y'all do not want to see me yawning eyes watering and everything um i pretty much edited everything but I what the inspirational message for today is is to to relax and i'm speaking to those people who may be overwhelmed with something that is completely out of their hands out of their control and the only thing you can do is give your glory to the highest and and, and trust that he's gonna oversee the situation the way he needs to and i know with myself like i'm just like i'm just 
I'm the type of person who freaks out about every little thing. Um, and I will be praying, praying, praying. And I'm trusting, trusting, trusting. And I'm still questioning, questioning, questioning. So, um, I just want everybody to relax, breathe. There's things that are running heavy on your mind or your heart right now. Uh, that things have a way of working themselves out and everything's gonna be okay everything is gonna be okay you guys and yes yeah, so just stay positive i love y'all was my eyes closed this whole time i need i need to go but i'm gonna probably sleep by the time um babe gets back here but i don't feel like putting on this bonnet whatever i'm about to get my hair done oh yeah but um yeah you guys i love you guys so much and i'll see y'all tomorrow what's the best way like we want to be like that family business that people comes to because come to sorry because they trust us and they really want to rock with us all of our clients literally say to us you got me as a client for life because we're very attentive and we're there for you um